According to government estimates, among the Indians repatriated to India, around 10 lakh of them are in Kerala. Many of them, like Nand Kumar and Sai, are likely to be first-time voters in this election. Sneha with the details. Nand Kumar and Sai, two expats who had to return to Kerala in the last one year, find themselves in starkly different situations. 58-year-old Nand Kumar lost his job in Saudi due to downsizing and returned to Kerala by mid-Jan 2020. In the thick of the pandemic, Nand Kumar managed to open a paint retail shop with his savings and a subsidy of 1.5 lakhs for the loan approved through the state government's non-resident Kerala's affairs, NORCA, a nodal body. Now, still people are, many people are uh, sacked on their position. And they're coming back to Kerala? Yeah, yeah. Many of them are already here. And I said, welcome. No problem, government is supporting. But it's been tough for 46-year-old Sai Ramalingam Pillai Krishan, who lost his job in Bahrain due to the country's nationalization policy and company restructuring, leaving him stranded before he managed to return to Kerala by May 2020 amid a raging pandemic through the Vande Bharat mission two months after he enrolled for seats with his family. Sai says his plans to start a business has been hit with anxiety, worry. If I need to stay back here and take care of my family, I need to start something of my own. Getting back into a job and getting a decent salary here in this condition, it is very difficult. The situation here in Kerala, how conducive is it for people like me to start a business? NRK includes return migrants, emigrants, internal migrants and return internal migrants. Almost I would put close to 40 to 45 lakhs. And all of them are eligible voters. And, right. who, and whoever are going to get more votes from the NRK is likely to come back to power. According to government estimates of those who have been repatriated to India, around 10 lakhs are in Kerala. And like Nanda Kumar and Sai, many of them would be first-time voters in decades in Kerala, a decisive vote bank for any political party. With camera person SP Babu, Sneha Koshi for NDTV.